वेलकम टू पवित्र लैपटॉप मिस्टर आंजयन परम वेलकम सो टुडे टॉपिक इज चार्जिंग सेक्शन दिस इज द इलेवेंथ जनरेशन बोर्ड सो टुडे इज द फाइनल क्लास इफ इट इज ओवर सो नेक्स्ट वील गो फर्दर टॉपिक्स ओके सो दिस इज द लेटेस्ट बोर्ड आई सी वॉट द आई सी नंबर बुक्ट Uh, to remember once again so just you watch the video you can easily understand okay now so charging section what the first input section that we will check in cro all voltages we will check in dso okay what the first voltage 19 volts 19 volts right so from where it will come pdb1 pdb PDP one. Nineteen B underscore V na. First PDP one na. PDP one. Three. Ah, there is a pin number three. PDP one, right? So that actually first voltage. This PDP one. There is pin number three. Sorry, this is a three. So second CLR. I'll make it five. Okay, now. 19.92 that is the input of voltage diode okay yes. we need to check output section because output has gone to pin number 1 pin number 28 actually that through the register, through the register. Hmm? Yes. so this is the diode input and diode output i am checking diode output is 19.53 you know the reason why yes. it it got dropped it will drop output actually it's a diode three leg diode okay input is 19.9 but output is 19.5 it will drop in internally 0.4 to 0.6 or 0.9 it is depends hmm see 19.5 hmm the output voltage is 19.53 so exact value should be there the output of the diode three led diode the same voltage should be input of the charging ic If any major, I mean major variation in the voltage, mm -hmm. so there there will be a chances of uh, that particular resistor is there, right? Mm -hmm. That may be got burned, or somewhere internally it's weak. Mm -hmm. That resistor value is completely weak, or resistor value is high. Because of high only, you will get less voltage. Yes. Okay. See, some cases you will get it. It will work through battery. It's not through adapter. <coughs> in that case, you need to check this particular resistor. ओके सेकंड वोल्टेज पिन नंबर सिक्स सो थ्रू द वोल्टेज डिवाइडर पिन नंबर सिक्स ए सी डिटेड विल जनरेट राइट चेक द डी एस ओ इट्स टू पॉइंट नाइन थ्री इफ यू डू द कैलकुलेशन द वोल्टेज डिवाइडर विल बी देर सी दट इनपुट ऑफ दिस पर्टिकुलर रजिस्टर विल बी नाइनटीन पॉइंट नाइन दस इनपुट वोल्टेज एंड आफ्टर डिवाइडर टू पॉइंट नाइन टू पॉइंट नाइन This is the voltage. Yeah. This is straight line. Yes. Straight line. Okay. Yes, so next. Ah. Yes, sir. See the voltage. Twenty-four. Right. Yes. So in DSO we can't see. So maximum twenty voltage we can see. Hmm. Next. See here. We we'll make it five. Then ninety point nine two. Number twenty-four. Twenty-four. That is connected to PCB one, right? Mm. Check that resistor. Wait, as connected. Pin number twenty-four. Mm. Come right side. Still okay. Charger. The circuit is not connected on the board. So see here. Ah, Param. Ah. Check here in DSO. It's a straight line. Ah. Okay. It's a five point six volt. Five to six, any volt. In between any voltage, it will come. Reason, it's coming. Okay, it's good. Next. Next. ACP AC. Hmm. ACP AC. What about adapter information? ID. IAD. Okay. Anyway, that also you can check. ACP AC and also you can check. 
built a standard commercial or upper sale hmm. see one and this two. this capacitor 20.19.9 okay hmm. which was the basic one right? uh, ah acn acn cellar acn acn after cellar hmm. okay next acp i am checking acp is this capacitor here 19.92 hmm. okay next next huh? hmm. srp srn SRP, SRN. Hmm. What about AC? Okay. Ah, AC okay. When it will come? First, sir, AC okay. Hmm? After. Uh, Forget. Okay. First, hmm. AC okay. After that one, I. I okay. Do. What is the pin number? AC file okay. I number. Sure. Ah. Sure. <coughs> what is the voltage? AC okay. Three point one two. Okay. AC okay. Three point one volts. You have to check the DSO. Ah. It's a sine wave or straight wave. You need to check. Hmm. Okay, next. Sir. IAD. Hmm. Current information, right? Hmm. What it should be? Sir. IADP. IADP five eight six. So we check in DSO. Check the voltage. Hmm. Hmm. That's the better information, right? First, this one, sir. Which one? After. Hmm. SRP, SRM. Okay, that also we can check. But see, once region generated, uh -huh. then step down IC will generate, right? Uh -huh. Step down IC will generate three volts LDO. Yes. After, after okay. that, AC OK will come. Uh -huh. No, before AC OK. Uh -huh. Hmm. Because AC OK is the outsource input; it will take, right? So pull up through the pull up register, so it gives 3.1 volts. Correct. Hmm. So that pull up uh, from where it has come, so it has come through the step down AC. Correct. Yes. So once step down AC is activated, then AC OK will come. Before that, only 19 volts path will be available. Hmm. Correct. So that ACP ACN, when that 19 will cross, then only it will start. That charging IC will. Check that ACP, ACN and SRC. What is that? SR, SRP and SRN. SRP and SRN. Hmm, that actually, uh, why it will check? So battery is connected or not, adapter is connected or not, that voltage information it will collect. And then it goes to I.O. Yeah. Right, After through that ACOK. -OK. Ah. Once ACOK -OK is good, then ILIM and what is that? ID charge. ID charge. Hmm? That will go to I.O. Those information is current related information. Yes. So now we have to check that current related information in the sense which one? IADP. ILIM. Okay. ILIM and IADP. Something is there, no? That one. What is that? ILIM. Hmm. Pin number? Uh, ILIM. Pin number 21. Pin number 21. What are the voltage? 0 0.6. 0 0.8. 6. 632. Milliamps. Ah. Okay. Hmm? Uh, this, these are the color, uh, current information mm. that will go to goes to IO. <coughs> okay. Next. Pin number seven. IADP. IADP. DP. It is pin number seven, right? Uh. These are the current. This also current related. IADP. See, seven or something. So auto will do. Very less voltage will be there. Point two, na. Zero point zero. It's varying. Hmm. Right, sir. Zero point zero seven. It's varying actually. Zero point zero seven will be there. Usually. Okay. Next. ID charger. So now current related information over. ID charger. Hmm, ID charge also is there, but it's not used. Anyway, we will check. What is that? Pin number? 8. 8. See, that's 1 point something voltage will go to ID. 1 point? 
upon me. There is no voltage. There is no voltage. No. Okay, next. Which one? Uh, this one uh, high drive. Mm -hmm. Directly high drive and low drive. Huh? Mm -hmm. Are you sure? <coughs> mm -hmm. Don't go there. Uh, SRP, SRP. Hmm. That also over. That information directly goes to I.O. Next, now you check the SRP and SRN. Here, actually, battery is not connected, right? Mm. Yes. Hmm. Tell me. Next. After that, one SD, SD. One minute. Okay. I will check the SRP and SRN. Hmm? See here, 214 millivolts in mm. SRP. Sorry, SRN. Okay, so next SRP. Two fourteen millivolts. Two fourteen millivolts. In SRP and SRF without battery. Without battery. Mm -hmm. Both same sir. Both both are same. Very small amount of uh, what is that? Voltage will get dropped. Okay. Because it's very less resistance will be there, right? Mm. So next SDSL. Ah. SDA SCL. This is very very important section. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm. So in case of no battery or battery not charging, plugged in not charging. Mm. Now it's plugged in because all current uh, current related adapter uh, adapter related uh, information goes to I/O. Mm. Then IO AC work okay also gone. Even IM also over. These all are adapter related uh, information. Next, that battery related information will come. Okay. So there is a uh, pin that's called BI ash that we need to check first. Okay. This charging IC will check that BI ash. Which pin? Pin number 15. Right. So battery is connected or not, that it will check first. Then uh, SDA-ACL communication will start. Uh, yes. At present SDA-ACL having 3 volts. <coughs> but communication path, I mean that waveform will be there now, that won't generate. Right. So what we have to check? Battery present. Mm. Battery present, which one? Battery, pin number battery present, pin number 15. Uh. Okay. See in the DSO, what will be the voltage? Mm. See, three point. Param, three point zero four yes. voltage. Okay. Mm. In battery presence, what it means? Now in battery presence, three volts is there. Yes. Uh, so what about it? So disable or enable? Hmm? It's enable. It's enable. No, sir, no, after connect, after connect. It's not connected. No, what no, is this? Now it's a disable, disable right? Disable. So when voltage will be there, then it's a disable. Yes. When we connect the battery, then we will check. Zero. It's a zero or Enable. three point three. Hmm? Mm -hmm. We'll check. Mm -hmm. Now I'm connecting the battery. Okay. See, I connected the battery. Here, light Switch. went and come. Okay. Now I will check the battery present. In number 15. In number 15. See the DSO? No voltage. Mm -hmm. It means it's ash, right? It's enable now. Mm -hmm. It's enable actually. Sometimes you will get 0 0.5 volts also. Mm -hmm. You ignore that. Actually, it's in off condition only. Okay. okay, now battery is connected. Next. Param. <coughs> Hmm. See now it's a battery connected, right? Mm. So, what are the functions will start? Mm. Battery charger. Hmm. Okay. Here SDACL. SDACL is no more, sir. Hmm? Even. <laughs> Not 
first battery has to After connect. Connecting that battery only SDSCL will come. This is not the same. Without battery, how we can check SDSCL? Ah, yes. Okay, now uh -huh. that SDSCL 3 volts will be there, uh -huh. but communication won't start. Won't start. Once that high low MOSFET will start, right? So when battery voltage output will come, then the communication between battery and charging IC will start. Mm -hmm. So now high drive and low drive we need to check first. Mm -hmm. Because once MOSFET is active, then only the communication that is DACL will start. Okay, mm -hmm. now which one? High low MOSFET. High drive. First, high drive. 26. High drive and pin number? 26, 26 right? Uh, 26 and 23. Hmm. First, we will check 26. Upper gate. <coughs> hmm. You need to check the DSO. Upper gate. Pin number 25. 26. See here? Straight line is showing. Hmm. You know why? Battery is completely charged now. Yes. That's why it is in off condition. Mm. In case battery is discharged, so it will show the waveform. Wave mm. Understood? Understood? Now voltage is available, 12.5 volts available. This is the battery section voltage. Yes. Hmm? Not high, high MOSFET uh, one, okay? Mm. Because it's completely charged, fully charged. That's the reason you, you are getting down. only this battery voltage. Mm. Next, lower gate, lower, right? Lower gate. That also we will check. What is the number? 23. Sure. Yeah. Okay. See here. Low drive won't be there. That will be zero. Okay. Uh -huh. High drive in the sense it's connected to battery. That's why we are getting battery voltage. Mm -hmm. Now low drive nothing will be there. Until unless it cut discharge, so till the time it will be zero. Okay, once it discharge, then we will get the voltage. <coughs> Next, last page. Hmm. No, it's the SCL. Now we will check. Hmm? Face starts. Which face? Face. Face. Face will start. Okay. Yes. Now see, high low MOSFET is not there. Then face won't start. But anyway, we will check the face. Which number? 27. 27. That's coil voltage. Ah, coil voltage. See the coil input? Nothing is there. Hmm. Okay, nothing will be there because it's in off condition. Hmm. High low MOSFETs are in off condition, but battery is connected, so that's why battery voltage you will get 12.7 volts. Okay, so then next yes, communication yes. we will check is D A S C L. Hmm? What is the pin number? Eleven twelve. What? Eleven twelve. Eleven and twelve. Hmm. See here, you will get three point one two five. See the communication is happening or not? See here, this is very important. Param, mm. see here. Battery is connected, mm. but some information you are getting, right? right. See? Keep on seeing, see? Yeah. Understood? Yes. This battery is full now. Yes. Which number we are checking? Pin number 11. 11. What is that? SL. Uh, SL. SDA. SDA. Understood? DA1. Yes. Yes. Uh, charger. SCA. What is that? SDA. SDA. What yeah. is that? Data. Data. data sir. See, data looks like this. Yes. Alright. Now battery is connected. That's the reason you are getting this kind of data. Hmm. See, I paused it. See, it will be like this. This is called data. Hmm. Okay, Param. Mm, now we will check yes, clock. Actually, first we need to check the clock, <coughs> then data. Mm. Without clock, data won't be there. Through the clock only, data will go. Okay. Correct. Mm. So now we will check 
data. What is the number? Sorry. Twelve. 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 See, high means it's a one, mm. zero, one, one, zero, zero, one, zero, one, zero. So double means it's a one, one. Understood? See the time. Mm. So then it's a zero, one, 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 like that it will go. Yes. This is very important. Mm. So without DSO, you can't identify. Actually, normally you will get the three words in SD and SCL. Mm. But when you check in DSO, then only communication. We can we can capture. Yes. Okay. This is the only way to capture the communication of battery. It's a DSO. Okay. Now you understood the point, right? So in output section at present there will be no battery. Actually, battery is completely charged. So that's the reason it's not working. It's not functioning. It's current. Connect. Hmm. Connect. 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 First, we'll check. Yes. yes. See now, from okay. low drive. Ah. Ah. How it looks? Cam. Yes. See now it's charging. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> yes, Actually, I think so. you you have seen right. Yeah. So that's very important section. Mm -hmm. hmm? See once it. Charging will start, then only that waveform you will get. Hmm. Once it completely charged or hmm. not charging, that time waveform won't be there. Understood? Understood. Okay. Uh, this so actually battery to the no remote remote communication is happening. Hmm. Communication is happening. High MOSFET also I wanted to show you, but anyway. Oh, no. After <laughs> after working high MOSFET only that will <laughs> No no that uh, image I wanted to show you. Just a minute, just a minute. Ah, just a minute. Just a minute. Ah, just a minute. Auto? Ah, auto. Use auto. Ah, 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 auto. Actually, this battery is dead, but anyway, let us check. Hmm? What? I don't know, it's going to block. Uh -huh. Shall I connect it? Wait, wait, wait. Turn that. Ah, now you connect. Ah, ah see? Ah. Got it? Don't stop. Okay? Yes. It looks like this. Mm. Oh, see, you remove this? Wait, 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 I can use it. No need to switch on. No, no, no. It will, it, uh, it will get discharged, right? Actually, this battery is not good. Mm. Sometimes it will charge and immediately it will get discharged. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Now, connect. See? Mm. See, the, this one is high MOSFET. High MOSFET gate. I mm. will increase the voltage. See, it looks like this. Mm. Okay. Yeah. Now, it got completely charged, so it looks like this. Mm. Now I will show you the input so of the coil. Input of the coil. See how it, how it looks uh, looks like. Just a minute. Mm. Uh, ah, this way. Ah? Okay. Now check the input section of mm. input section of coil. Mm. Okay. <coughs> the output section will be straight line. 30 yeah. volts. Now again I will show you input section. Mm -hmm. High low, high low, high low switching function will be going on. Keep on going on. Yeah. Till the complete charge or remove the battery. Understood? Mm -hmm. This is very very important. In DSO, HDACL path, battery, uh, what is that? 
uh, high low MOSFET gates. These we can check in DSO. It will show sinusoidal waves or square waves, pulse. Okay, you will get the voltage, but sometimes charging issue will come. In that case, you need to check the DSO. That is compulsory. What are the section? High low MOSFET gate and input section of the coil should be in sign form. That is SDSL. That is very important. That is the communication part. Okay, anything else related to this? One more, oh, one more time you can check. Connect this. It will come, sir. Oh. See? See the input section? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Actually, battery is done. That's why it's showing like this. Yeah. Shall I remove this battery? Yeah. Ah. Now, anything else? Nothing. Hmm? Plugged in, not charging, battery not connected, battery connected but not charging, these all are we can check in DSO. Once you get that waveform then only it will charge or it will connect or it will show some other things. If you won't get any clock or data then battery won't charge. You, you may get the voltage but battery won't charge. It's not connected. Hmm? Here is the conclusion of charging section. Next, we will move to some other section. Thank you, sir. After output, okay. hmm. Yeah, tell me. Okay. After output, DC. That continuation, no, no. next DC chapter. AC will come. AC won't come. If AT comes, the, the coil won't function in proper way. What coil does? What coil does? Just now I told you. That is yeah, DC allows. Ah, it DC allows the DC and uh, reject the, 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 the AC. Right. Uh -huh. So input will be AC, mm. output will be DC. DC. In case output also you are getting AC, then that coil is faulty. Usually main coils won't be faulty. Yes. Ninety-nine mm. percent won't be faulty. One percent anything uh, may be happening. Rare, so that's very rare case. Sir. That's why I'm telling. Mm. So the main thing <coughs> is input will be AC, output will be DC. Mm. In case if you are getting AC, then coil will be faulty. You have to replace the coil. Yeah? Yes. Hmm? We'll move to next section. In future, if you uh, don't have any, what is that, uh, uh, notes, that time you can see this video and come to know. Okay? okay. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, Mr. Param and uh, Anji.